on adventurers, welcome to Evergreen Cemetery in Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. We're back in Gettysburg because we've had such high demand and we've also been having high demand to go to cemeteries. So, you know, it's the best of both worlds here, guys. Right behind us, a couple rows back, there is a statue of a lady that towers over all the other monuments and that is Jenny Wade, our good friend from the other world. Uh, yeah, so we're gonna try and make communication with her. We've got the spirit box with us. We'll see, I am very confident that she's gonna come through because she always has. Um, she surprised us in a couple locations. We, The first time we spoke to her was in Cemetery Hill, which is actually right across the road there. Um, and then we spoke to her again, I believe it was at Little Round Top. She came through. So, you know, we've had really good luck communicating with her. We love talking to her. She's a she's a joy to converse with. She's cool. I really like her. And I kind of wish that we would have had a chance to know her in life because she probably would have been a friend. Yeah. So let's go ahead and do this, guys. Uh, we have our equipment. Today we're going to use the spirit box. Yeah, I'm super stoked about this. So let's go. If you're not already currently subscribed to our channel, we ask that you please take a minute to do so. That way you'll be notified when new videos come out. And please, if you enjoyed this video, smash that like button. Hey everybody, we're here at the Evergreen Cemetery in located in Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. And this is a very uh, famous cemetery. It has a lot of history. So we stopped by um, to see uh, some of the monuments. The one that is most famous is the Jenny Wade Monument. We're actually at Cemetery Hill, and she came through on our EVP and a uh, live session, which was pretty exciting. So this time we decided actually to come to where she is laid to rest. And also this cemetery has a history. Um, apparently Abraham Lincoln gave the Gettysburg Address here, which is apparently a little known fact. Everybody thinks it's a different location, um, but apparently it was right here. I uh, noticed that the the wind's picking up, actually. Uh, yeah. That flag was completely still a couple minutes ago when I was over here. So, so good just, indication that Jenny might be joining us soon. So Jenny may join us. We're going to turn on our spirit box and see if she'll say hello to us and um, anybody else that wants to come through. So. Okay, so hello. Any, anybody want to say hello? Jenny, if you're here, want to say hello? I can't see the K2 meter, you're gonna have to... Uh, oh, she said something. Jenny, are you here with us? Anybody wanna say hello? Anybody here from the Civil War? Yep. yep. Nice to meet you. Would you like to say your name? Introduce yourself. Any soldiers here? Any officers here? Hello. Jenny, we, we spoke with you a couple times before. Can you come through and say hello? Hi. We talked to you about your bread before. <laughs> I'm gonna be quiet, they're very talkative. Jenny, do you remember us? She said I remember. I have a a meter here that will detect if you're if you're close by. Can you come close to the meter for us? Please touch my meter for me. The one I'm holding in my hand. Where are you? Look how windy it got all of a sudden. All of a sudden I feel ooh, the wind is kicking. Are you nearby? Uh, 
Can you say hello? Who, who's making it windy? So we appreciate that everybody wants to talk to us at the same time, but we can't understand what any of you are saying, so right now I'd like to just talk to Jenny for a couple minutes, if that's okay, guys. Interesting. Jenny, can you come back through and say hello? It smells something. Like food. It smells like those fritters at the Farnsworth house. Yeah, fritters. Oh, I just got to chill my whole arm. Jenny, is that you making it smell like fritters here? All of a sudden. Yeah, I think she said yes. Quiet. Come on, quiet. She said me. Do you love apple? Do you love apple fritters? She said apple? No, they think they're pumpkin. Oh, pumpkin. Is it pumpkin? Now, I don't want to be biased, but Jenny, I have to say you're our favorite person so far that we've talked to ever. That was interesting. I did. Did she say raptor? I'm pretty sure I heard raptor. This is Jen, and my name's Lisa. Lisa. Hi. Do you remember us? Hello. Do you like it here? Looks like somebody brought you flowers. Who brought you flowers? Do you like flowers? Every day. Do you do you visit your house? Her house is right down the street from here where she lives. Actually, they have tours of that. So. Jenny, what was your favorite thing to bake? <laughs> How old were you when you died? No, she was 20. Did you hear that though? Yeah, I don't know why it would say Maybe 16. somebody else. Not me. Oh. Okay. Who was 16 when they died that wants to talk to us? Elvin? 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 That was a female voice. The person that said 16 was a guy who's probably a young soldier. Yeah. Were you a young soldier that was killed in battle? The 16-year-old? A lot of soldiers, I think, are coming through. Can you speak one at a time? Who was 16? Okay, I'm seriously hearing something over here. Yeah. Yes. I think somebody's walking behind me. Who was 19? All right, listen, is somebody over here walking behind me? Probably. Oh, I just got to chill again. Oh my gosh. I really got to chill that time. Who's walking behind Jen? Who's making, who's making
making that win? Right behind you. Somebody right behind me? <laughs> Is Jen facing you? Is the camera facing you? Tell us to say yes when the camera is facing you. I want whoever is talking to us to um, materialize right behind Lisa. Just do not touch me. You're not allowed to touch her. You're not allowed to bother her in any way. But you are allowed to appear on camera so people can see you and hear your story. Can you show yourself? Jenny, I would love it if you would show yourself. I know it takes a lot of energy, but you can do it. Are you on this side of me? My left? They right. say right. Are you on the right? Are you right? We are getting so many responses here today, guys. It's a little hard to make out, but I know when I play it back with the headphones, I'm gonna be able to make it out a little bit better. I think we've got some pretty extraordinary things here today. I'm super impressed. Although I didn't I didn't expect anything less from Jenny Wade because she always is good company. So anybody else wanna say something? Emily. Is it Emily? Is there an Emily? <laughs> Say yes. Is there an Emily? Now I just wanted to let you guys know something. Her name is Jenny Wade, but her real name is Mary Virginia. And they actually it got lost in translation. They used to call her Ginny for Virginia. Oh. But somehow it ended up becoming Jenny. So it was kind of a misprint. Um, and that was how she ended up being known, which is terrible to be known by the wrong name. Are there any officers here today? We met, uh, we spoke with the officer, um, General Buford. Buford, uh, at Little, uh, was it Little Round Top? Yeah. Little Round Top, he came through. He said me. You're welcome. Is that General Buford? Hello? Howdy. Did he say howdy? <laughs> Did you? Yeah. You you like to ride horses. General Buford, I believe, was cavalry, is that right? Did somebody just touch me on my back? Yeah. Who's that? Who touched Jen? Anybody else wants to say hello? What was that? Well, we were going to wrap it up, but you guys are really starting to come through and be very clear. So, what do you want to be known? We're going to we're going to have this video up for all the world to see. What do you want to say to them? April? Did you say making bread? Did you say making bread? You gonna make some bread for us? We love your bread, Jenny. You want us to come back? Would you all like us to come back and visit you again? Yes. Keep coming. Well, we want to say thank you so much for you guys talking to us today. We do appreciate it. And... <laughs> they just want to keep going. Okay, guys. <laughs> you know, it's kind of like when you're on the phone with a little kid. Right. And you just can't hang up on them. <laughs> okay. You just can't. Not now. You guys are doing really well coming through for us. Thank you. It's nice to speak with you all. Remember? Remember? 
Do you remember the Civil War? Probably doesn't seem... Over here again. Is there anybody else here walking around? Any spirits? I know. That's what I keep hearing. Behind me. Maybe that's bad. I don't know. I'm hearing it over here. Yeah. Well, I think we're going to go. It's getting a little bit cold. <laughs> You're going to go too? Okay. All right. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us today. We do appreciate it. And we'll be back soon, guys. All right. Thank you. We're going to close this out. We wish you peace. Uh, just We ask you to remain here. And do not follow us. Um, we are protected by the power of Jesus. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. I'm pretty sure the last thing that said, came through was bye. They just, it said thank you, they didn't and then stop. right as you're cutting off, it said bye. Did oh you hear that? Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, guys, we got so many amazing responses here on the Spirit Box today at the Evergreen Cemetery. Thank you so much to Jenny Wade for coming through. We appreciate it. We had so many other spirits coming through on the Spirit Box. Our best guess is that it was soldiers that fought in the Civil War. One person came through and said they were 16. I believe another came through and said they were 19. And uh, we know for a fact that Jenny was 20 when she passed, so it definitely was not her. Thanks so much for joining us again, guys. We do appreciate it. And we'll see you on our next Raptor, Raptor Adventure. Adventure.